Hello, grade five. So, how to do rhythms. In front of you, you can see a four measure melody using the pentatonic scale that we talked about. This one and the third one are the same. This will give the melody uh, some structure and make it sound good to the listener and it makes compositional sense. Let's listen to the whole thing and then work out how to do it. So there it is. So let's just delete it all. First thing you've got to remember for this activity, guys, is we're only going to be using quarter notes, eighth notes, and sixteenth quarter, eight sixteenth notes. We're not going to be using anything else because we don't need to for this activity. Please don't use this one with the three flags or the four flags. Just quarter, eighth. And 16th notes. Let's look at how to punch those in. So we'll start off with quarter notes. Click on your quarter note. Easy peasy. Ta 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 ta. Quarter notes. Eighth notes sounds like this. Again, these are not very exciting, but I'm just going to show you how to do it. And we've got the 16th notes. Easy. Now, on its own, this is not going to make for a very good melody. So we need to combine these ones, 8th notes and 16th notes together. We've talked about that a little bit. Uh, I like to think of them as ta and titi. So if I'm going to combine a rhythm, I want to go ti, tika, ti, tika, 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 ta. T tika T tika 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 ta. Okay, how am I gonna do that? So I'm gonna go eighth note here. Sixteenth. Do that again. And then I'm just by the way, I'm just punching in A on the keyboard to make my note. Then I go sixteenth notes. And then I'll go to So here's a nice simple rhythm that we could do something with. Okay, that rhythm there in the third measure. So, um, but it's not a melody at the moment. We want to start on A and finish on A. And remember, we're using the pentatonic, so C, D, E, G, and A. No F and no B. No Facebook in the world of music at this stage. So, what we'll do is... Interesting. I'll change this to a quarter note. There we go. So there's my first measure. Very simple. Uh, for the next one, I'm, I might want to have a different kind of melody, like a tika ti tika ti or something. So let's go to here. And again, we'll do the rhythm first. So it's just easier sometimes to just do all the rhythm first. Do it again. Okay, we're going to end on A, start on A. Sounds like it might sound very strange. Yeah, not bad, okay. Then we're going to have this one again because we want the first measure and the third measure to be the same. And then the last measure, we can do something completely different. Uh, let's go 16th notes again. Oops, here. 16th notes. Let's go. And then we'll do 
a symphony down here. And then we'll have a couple of quarter note A's at the end. Lots of A's. <laughs> Why not? Here is my um, four measure melody starting here. Easy. And what I'm going to do, we don't need this here at the beginning, that's just for you to, to show you how to punch stuff in. So I'm delete that. Uh, and then I'm going to put click on a note in the last measure and I'm going to add a repeat mark. So to add a repeat mark, we go up to the top and we click on measure. You can see measure here. And then I'm going to click write repeat. And this means it will play the whole thing twice. <laughs> it gets okay so you're going to put a repeat mark in the end four measures this one so the first measure and we're going to repeat this many times so you get it the first measure and the third measure are the same you can see that we've centered around the a so we start on a finish on a start on a finish on a start on a finish on a here i started on a c but i finished on a make sure you always finish on a for each measure it's going to really bring it back home to that a a minor pentatonic that we talked about um, and that's it guys so have fun with it we look forward to seeing your simple four measure rhythms if you want to go above and beyond and add some other stuff you can but make sure you only add a drone okay uh, in fact no just do this this is nice and simple because we're going to build on this the following week try to make a melody that sounds good starts on a ends on a keeps coming back to that a minor uh, that we're focusing on this week um, and try to give the melody some shape and repeated patterns so that it sounds or that it makes sense uh, to the listener okay guys good luck <laughs>